Hello everyone, Admiral Seabass here, ready for Russian Turn 2 Global 40 R2. Uh, so here's my purchases for this turn. Three guys, actually six guys, three will go in Leningrad, three will go in Ukraine, three tanks, and a tech roll. Um, and in looking at the situation, I decided I've got to do a counterattack somewhere. And I can't let an opportunity go to hit to counterpunch the Germans. And I was thinking about it, the German center looks relatively weak compared to the left and the right. So let's hit the center. So there's my target. A lot of those units are going to go in in the planes. And uh, there's what I'm going to buy to compensate. So let's see about the tech roll. Definitely going to do wartime economy to try to boost some Russian income. So we need a seven or higher. Nope. Did not get it. So I only have one combat move. And uh, I'm going to make that now. And I'll be back. You know what? I'll just show you my combat move. The hope is, by moving these units in here and hitting the relatively weak German middle, that we're going to force the Germans to divert troops from here or here that they otherwise would have taken into Ukraine or Leningrad to take out my stacks there. So we're going to bring as much as we can in here and hope we can get the Germans' attention in the middle because you know what? If they don't deal with us, we can drive. We can take Warsaw, maybe even Berlin. Uh, so these planes are going to come in, and they're going to have two. They're going to have two fuel points left, and I think that's all we can get in there this turn uh, to hit them back. So uh, let's move this to the battle board. So here's what the battle looks like. Uh, my tactical bumps up to a four paired with a tank. So uh, let's roll it out. I got five Russian guys at one. Grab five of these grasshopper dice. So five at one. Nothing. Okay, I've got three at f three and one at four. So three blues, one at four. Two hits. You know, honestly could have expected a lot better if you're the Russians. But again, this is all about sawing the Germans down. So we've got five German guys at two. That'll be five green dice. And there's two hits. So we'll take these two Russian guys off. Look at this kill pile I got going here from the last couple of turns. So Russians, three at one, three at three, and three at four. So there's three black dice, three blue dice, one at four. So let's roll all those at the same time. I need three hits, and I got them. And then the Germans will shoot back with three at two and they get no hits okay so we'll remove that german roundel we'll bump the soviets up one the germans down one and i'll replace those uh, russian units there and uh, then we'll do non-combats so there are the victors there in eastern poland we're going to move the planes back to Smolensk, where they came from. Put the fuel gauge marker back. These guys stay. This guy from Archangel is going to move up here to be a new blocker. Um, I think what we're going to do is... Put one blocker here, move the rest of these guys in here, in Ukraine, move these guys up there. These guys are both going to move up there. That's a central location. You can hit, literally hit almost any place from there and counterattack. Uh, and then I think these guys will move up here, 
and I think oh the sub we're gonna try to get him out one two into the Atlantic just to be a pest so that does it for the Russians in terms of non-combats um, now let's place units so three guys from here go into Leningrad pretty sure Leningrad is going to get hit amphibious assault and from these guys but so we want to put as many guys in there as we could to defend these three guys are going to go into Ukraine And those two factories are maxed out, so the tanks will go into Russia. Okay, and the Russians will collect income and come back with that in a minute. Okay, Soviets get no bonuses. So they've got 20, 30, 5, 6, and that matches their income level. $36 they'll be able to spend next turn. And, um, yeah, the Germans have got to plug their middle there. And I think the Soviets did what they wanted to do, which is some of those southern and northern German units are going to have to come into the middle to deal with those Russians. Um, so, yeah, we'll see what the Germans do in response next turn. All right, that's R2, Admiral Seabass, out.